Is it like a suede? It is a suede. It's like a suede fabric with all oh this applique on. That is gorgeous. Oh, I've fallen in love. I can't fall in love with a book tour at night. <laughs> So this is maybe part two. Yes. <laughs> if we actually get too much footage today, I'm gonna split this video. And yeah, that's why if you haven't seen part one yet, please go and check it out. Um, we got so much footage already in last, we last, did. In the last video, right? Yeah. I was like, oh my god, usually it's so difficult guys to film in Vista Village. They are just as strict as inherit as yeah. everywhere. <laughs> yeah. So I would say let's head to the next shop and hopefully we're actually gonna find something today. Yes, I'm very excited. So lots of amazing stuff. stuff yes. in there. Okay, there's Dior guys. I would say let's go in and try our luck. So we are in Dior. Wow, what kind of saddlebag is that? That's quite cool. So very quickly, obviously, they don't want you to film here and they already stopped us again. <laughs> but hey, that's the game, right? So look at this little book tote. Um, what do we think about that? I've never seen that in a boutique either. Steph's just gonna get another one. And a little close-up shot of that one. And we can actually see the price. One six. That's a thousand pound less, guys. That is a thousand pound less than in the boutique for a book tote because they're around like what two and a half? <gasps> yes! Oh my god! I tried this one on in the boutique. I always loved it. Yes, this was 35%. Mm. Yeah, and uh, this is one six only. It's almost like a thousand pound less than you know in the boutique because they are what two and a half, I think. Yes. Wow. Let's see the price. Uh, yeah. And this is so cool. I always like that. That reminds me of like Alice in Wonderland kind of. Yeah, I feel like it's like Valentine's kind of story. Yes. Oh my god, I love these ones. <gasps> really pretty. Should we try some on? I absolutely love this pair, the gold and the black. And it is 564 pounds. Oh, really that's like really these. nice as well. Yeah. They are theoretically wedding shoes, right? Yeah. Some ready to wear pieces. <gasps> Look at this coat. Wow. I have to be really careful. He really stopped us already. Six and a half thousand. A little outfit of the day, just quickly. Uh, Steph, tell me what you're wearing today. So I've just got a roll neck jumper on. Um, I got this years ago. Um, some high waist trousers from mm -hmm. Zara. Some trainers because we are walking around all day. A lot. I was actually thinking about should I, should I put heels on? I was like, nah. Yeah. Too lazy. <laughs> I, I always want to, but I just know that my feet. Will the work reality too much. of it is like not gonna happen. No. <laughs> I got a disco coat from All Saints mm. and obviously my 19. I love it. This is the most beautiful piece we've seen in the boutique today that is like he was just pulling it out and i was like oh, let's look at that one yes is it like a suede it is a suede it's like a suede fabric with all oh this like god. on that's gorgeous oh i've fallen in love i can't fall in love with a book tour at night it's down it from four six yeah to three thousand pound basically to nine <gasps> Winner. put it on really? put it on it's a nice one. Yeah. I like, I like the stuff. It's small. Mm -hmm. This one might be a bit too big, but yeah. I really do like the colours. Like and it's a, it's a nice material yeah. with a suede. And Steph's trying yeah. to sneak some footage. Um, that's all they have on display. We got stopped a thousand times again at Dior. Yeah. However, I always like to say they're just doing their job, we're doing our job, exactly. so who cares? We are in Mulberry at the moment. Yes, I always really like the classic base water. Yes. You know, it's such a good bag for every day. You don't need to worry about it. Let's have a look if they actually have that one. So some nice totes. Mulberry is such an essentially British brand, guys. I really like it and yeah let's see what they have oh a lot of these tiny little bags love them too and there we can see it that is the oh yeah this one this is the classic um, base water basically I love it in their classic brown as well um, it's like a tan color that kind of color this is a smaller model yeah um, I think I really like the big one I think they have it as a backpack version as well. This is the Oxblood. So basically this bag in like a 10 is so beautiful, but the Oxblood is actually quite nice too. Huh. Do we like it? So it's of course stuffed. Like it doesn't look this big if you take all the stuffing out, obviously. Um, I like it. It's like a good, and you can actually put it over your shoulder. I can't do it at the moment because this gold is so thick. <laughs> um, but if I would take it off, you know, you can swing it over the shoulder. It's a nice bag. I think you can even use it as like a travel bag. It holds quite a lot. And the ox plot is nice, isn't it? Ooh, I really like these. Wow, that's quite a nice tweet, guys. And it's actually champagne gold hardware. Looks silverish, it's champagne. There we have a bigger size as well. Mm, this somehow gives me like Loewe vibes as well, I right? Think, yeah, that is the way it's style. folded. 
Um, it's gorgeous. Look at the detail. It's a little bit inspired by the puzzle bag, I would say. Yeah. Um, but it's nice. I always like everybody always says, oh, Mina, you have so many grandma bags with all the flowers on it. I love it, guys. Like the intricate <laughs> what can detail I say? Of is beautiful. Yeah, I really like this. Let's have a look at it. Mm. Love it. Love that it comes with this kind of like chain as well. It's like a little tortoiseshell style chain and then you have like this handle as well that comes with it. See? This little handle comes with it as well. And you have the chain. And the way you open this is quite cool too. Ooh, I like it. I think I'm fascinated by the shape of the bag. Mm -hmm. Steph is too. Yeah. <laughs> and this is like a little metallic version as well. Yeah, you could definitely get like bulky items. In yeah. 420. Oh, wow, this is even cheaper. Yes. <gasps> this is even cheaper than this one, guys. Wow. Found the one I spotted earlier as well, and she's trying it on. Put it on your shoulder. Let's see how it looks like. Okay. Yeah. It's like a like that's quite short. But it's quite nice. It has like the little 19 chain as well. Yeah. <laughs> so we're still fighting against the wind. Let's go and hide in Fendi. We are in Fendi. Yeah, which one do you like? Quite like the pink one up here. Yeah. And the straps are pretty cool. It's as well. nice. Mm -hmm. Those toads, they only came out recently, right? Yeah. Why are they already selling them? I've not seen them. Um, it's a new collection, see? Yeah. Okay, there we have some summer toes. They are from last summer's collection, I'm pretty sure. Um, they ended up here now. These models, again, you don't see in the boutiques. No. Not at all. And yeah, this is all they have at Fendi at the moment. Oh, guys, I'm not excited about anything, unfortunately. These teeny tiny little um, headphone bags. I don't know what you put in there. These little peekaboo bags. That is proper peekaboo. That's the history of how the peekaboo came alive. The original peekaboo bags actually had those eyes um, inside as well. Candigraphy bags. What do we think about those? This is the logo that Karl Lagerfeld designed. Yeah, it's like a cobalt logo. Yeah, I like it. I always like that logo. So windy, this thing just fell over. <laughs> I'm a bit nervous now. Hello! <laughs> okay, let's head into Givenchy. It's like the Antigona. I like micro. love the tiny ones. There's real python as well, I think. Mm, that's gorgeous. Okay, so what is this? This is the Antigona. This is the Antigona. And the style? What's the code? I'm not too sure what that one's oh, called. I love it. I never really looked into Givenchy, guys. Quick look at what's on display. Do we like any of this? I like this. Yes, I'm just drawn towards leopard and cheetah prints at the moment, I think. And look at the silver little python beauty and some mock rock shoes. Oh, very MS inspired, right? Definitely with the logo um, on the side. Love the so black. Um, the logo is very muted and I don't know, can you tell me anything about this? I think that's a very typical <gasps> Givenchy, right? They had the Yeah, they had the toad as well. Yes. Um, that yeah. sold out. When that came out years ago, uh -huh. that completely sold out. Oh wow. Here yeah, guys, that's the Rottweiler on a little pouch actually. There we can see it better. We are at Alexander McQueen. I always like the clutches. Um, let me know if any of you own Ale any Alexander McQueen bags. This would go well with your little mirror by mom bag. Yes, <laughs> it really would. Here, yeah, I can show you the handle from the other side that you can actually appreciate the beauty. Steph just said she likes the pink one. <laughs> I really like the purple. Oh yeah, that's nice that's with the gold. A, yeah, mm -hmm. and such a dark rich purple. Okay guys, so now we're gonna go to Prada. Yes. I literally got kicked out of Prada last time. Yeah. Um, without you any like warning. You, film. No. <laughs> you don't get a warning like in most places where they say, hey, please don't film. We're like, oh, oh sorry, we didn't know that. Of course we're gonna <laughs> stop filming. <laughs> Let's um, see how we do. Let's see how we do. Yeah. So last time they were really angry. Um, but it's a game. Right? I'm scared. Yeah. I, I always think it's just a game, guys. So let's head into Prada and then into Vivian Westwood because uh, Daycock wants to have uh, some eye candy to look at as well. They have Mew Mew here as well. And I really like these bags. I have to show you the toad in a second. I saw a pink one that I really like and I only saw bling and flowers and I really like it. So this is the bling bling strap, how I like to call it. <laughs> it is quite an eye catcher. Uh, I need to show you the top. I came into Prada and saw this Mew Mew bag and I was like, oh, beautiful flowers, a beautiful kind of soft baby pink. And mm, why am I such a sucker for those type of bags? 
<laughs> oh, I really don't know, but I like it. It's something different. Yeah. The pink is the nicest, pink is isn't it? Yeah, pink, yeah, yeah, I think the pink is I would the nicest. Like... Guys, a lot of color at Mio Mio. Very summery. Very summery. <laughs> this is beautiful. Is it? Does it feel like real uh, python or is no, it mock python? It doesn't feel real. Okay. It's a big belt buckle on you. I love it. Lots of Mew Mew and no Prada bags at Prada. Simple little Prada bag, but I really like this one. A little bit of a sneak peek in terms of what they have, but they really don't like anyone to film. And the same bag kind of in white. It's quite nice too. The nylon. Do we have any thoughts on Prada nylon bags? These are definitely my favorite that I've seen here today. Yeah. But still not so sure. We weren't uh, escorted off the property. No, we did well. <laughs> I think we're just the dream team. Yeah, yeah definitely. Although the stock was very disappointing. Very dis Everything yeah. in Vista is very disappointing. Yeah. <laughs> so this is uh, especially for Jacob because <laughs> he loves Vivian Westwood and I thought okay I'm gonna show you guys a little bit. They have these teeny tiny little cute bags. I love tote bags. You know they are literally just to swing them over their shoulder and go. I don't know why I want to go to California and go on holiday and just wear one of those toes there. Sorry for the lights flickering, um, but yeah, bad light bulbs again. Yeah, let me know guys if anything catches your eye. And Vivian Westwood, do you have any Vivian Westwood bags? Do you have any experiences with them? Let me know. And yeah. That's it. I just thought that I haven't found anything that I personally like, but look at this little croc, mock croc clutch. Oh yeah, yeah. I love that one a lot. And yeah, they have jewelry as well, guys. Hmm. Oh, and the second bag that I actually like a lot. Um, so this is made out of the material that Jacob has. I think he has one of those bags. Um, it looks quite amazing in real life, I have to say. <gasps> I love the colors. Let's look at this. Wow. I really like that. Yeah. It looks different from like any kind of perspective and how the light reflects on it. I like how the hardware is also. Yeah. I think this one's Oh yeah. I love it. And this is the same kind of wallet slash clutch um, in mock crop with gold. I'm always a nice. for black Yeah, I know, I know. And I think you could just, just use it as a big wallet in a Neverfoot or something like that, right? Chloe, yeah. guys, and this one caught my eye. That's quite an interesting style and kind of something that we haven't seen yet. Def has this bag, so if you haven't seen her video yet, please go and check it out. Um, it's quite, I think she got the small. It's quite a cute little canvas bag. Guys, look at this little Chloe bag. It has a little cute rat on it. <laughs> and the bag's actually quite nice, right? I like it. I like fuggy things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. Oh, yeah. Faye bag, yeah. and you're saying it's really heavy. Yeah, this Aww. is so heavy. My friend Faye actually wanted to get this bag. Did she? <laughs> yeah, she wanted. I mean, it's really nice and like yeah. the suede with the leather. It always reminds me of a bull that yeah. has the ring in the nose, yes. and it's just so weird. Let's go to Lueva. Do you want to try and pronounce it? Lueva. Yeah. <laughs> We tried several times, guys. <laughs> so um, I wish they would have some of the Totoro pieces. That would yes. be my dream. Look at this. How cool is that? Oh my god, this is, I think, my highlight yes, after definitely. everything we've seen today. I think this is quite cool. Are these like little strawberries? Uh, strawberries? Or is this a pineapple? I don't know. Oh, oh yeah, this one looks like strawberries. <laughs> uh, and look at this. That is quite cute as well. I wish they had some of the Totoro pieces. I would immediately buy it, honestly. This is a little scratch or this is birds, I don't know. <laughs> so it has a little embroidery here. This is actually stitched in this house, whereas the other stuff I think is printed onto the leather. And guys, look at this. They have Beijing as well. Oh, I love it. I want a Totoro bag. I'm so sad I missed out on those. Actually guys, I have only considered buying Louis Vuitton bag when the Totoro collection came out and the Spirited Away collection to be honest. But their stuff is nice. Oh, oh my gosh, we have frogs. Yes. And we have elephants. <laughs> These are ridiculous. Oh god, I have to look at the bunny. How yeah, cute is that? What can you use it for? Is it a coin purse? Yeah, coin purse? I guess a coin purse. You couldn't fit anything. Maybe you could get a card in there. Maybe yeah. not the bunny rabbit, but maybe the frog. Bunnies, frogs, elephants. Oh my I god. Know. Okay, Which guys. Go for? Bunny, frog. Yeah, let us know. <laughs> 
So they have a little New York bag as well. I love it. That is quite cool. Are they embroidered as well? No, they're only printed on London. Very interesting. Yeah, same. They had the black one in the window display, right? I like it too. Definitely. And these are the wicker bags that everybody is going crazy for as well. Here they are. Look at that. In all kinds of... No, it's the same... I wanted to say in all kinds of shapes and sizes, but nope. This is all the same size, but I'm pretty sure they come in like a smaller size as well. Yeah. I'm just looking for the price of the teeny tiny little bunny. Oh. And there we can see oh, it. 175. Oh! That's not, that's that's, not that's too bad. Not the yeah. Is it? yeah. I just thought it was black and unfortunately it's navy. Yeah, it's like a blue. <laughs> and you saw it in the tunnel last time. Yeah, they've got the tunnel. I wish time. they would have that one. A little frog guys, cute. How much is it? 90 pounds. Oh my wow. god, it's even cheaper than uh, yeah. Here's the black version of the birds. I think it's quite cute. Okay, so. Yeah, come with a little... My hair is horrible, guys, at the moment. I mean, the wind's been yeah. quite a thing yeah, <laughs> today. I think we're both happy once we're done with filming yes, and we don't need we, to worry about our hair anymore. We need to cover our hair. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I, I, I like prefer the size of yours, Yes. but I would like to have it in the black. Oh, I think yeah. I prefer this, this cream color. It's very nice for summer, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at this little turtle, guys. I like their pieces. I think I'm a Louis Vuitton fan now. I really like that. Yeah. So that was part two and yeah, we're done. We are. <laughs> it was a long day. It was. Right? I mean, I was already here at like 10 in the morning and now it's like almost five. <laughs> so it was successful. It's good that we got two videos Definitely. out, I think. Um, yeah, guys. So let me know what caught your eye and yes. uh, go check out uh, Steph's channel, of course. <laughs> so I would say if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, join our little handbag of Steph's family here. And oh, can we just look at the beautiful sun? Yes. Now the sun is coming out. <laughs> and yeah, guys, subscribe and everything you know the drill yeah <laughs> and i see you again soon bye, bye. bye.